Hi, we just finished meeting for pronunciation practice on October 15th, and we started with plethora, plethora. And if this is a noun, then the stress is on the first syllable, progress. And it could be spelled A-H, because that's how I represent the ah sound. Or if it helps you to think of it as A-W, like pra, that's fine too. Um, it's just the British will be pro Progress in American progress. We made good progress today. And the verb progress. Now the P R O is a uh, because it's not stressed. Progress. Shall we progress? Acclimating. May is underlined because it's secondary stress. It'll get a little longer, but not higher. So ac is high and longer. Acclimating. How are you, excuse me, how are you acclimating? Um, cluck is there um, to practice the CL, really the KL combination. When I say ACL, it's kind of the first part of cluck, like a chicken. Um, but the back of your tongue is making a K, and the front of your tongue is making an L and touching behind the top teeth at the same time. So it's really cl, cl. Hold your tongue in the L position so that the L noise can be heard. ACL, acclimating. Aggravation, aggravation. Make sure you have top teeth on bottom lip for V. A source of aggravation. And inspiration, inspiration. A source of inspiration. Um, I spread this out, but here's what it looks like not spread out. Um, divided into syllables. Mediterranean, Med this can be T or ter, because it doesn't matter if the R is on that side or the R is on that side, you're just going to hear one R. Mediterranean, Mediterranean. And you can say with the T, ornamental, or drop the T, ornamental. Your tongue's going to the N, and then instead of releasing the airflow T and back for the L, you just make it an N, ornamental ornamental, but it's not wrong to pronounce it with the T. It's just pretty common to hear it without. It's not functional. It's just purely ornamental. Squandered. Squan. It's kind of unusual, the SKW combination. Squandered. And that is there at the end to remind you to hold your tongue in the D position. Scattered. Scattered. Same thing. Hold the final D unless there's a vowel after it. Excuse me, then you will connect it. Leaves were scattered everywhere. Scattered everywhere. Partisan. And I learned today that you can pronounce this with an S. Partisan. So either way is correct, but the Z was first in the dictionary, meaning that's most common. So partisan. Sequoia. Sequoia. Torrential. Torrential rains. Searing. I know it looks like searing, but think of it as sear as the verb by itself. Sear. And then you're adding the ing. Searing. Cavalry. Cavalry. Squeamish. Squeamish. And the word by itself, clean, is pronounced with an E, clean. But for some reason, when we say this word, we change the E to an E, and it's clen. Cleanliness. Cleanliness. Don't know why. Clearance. Final clearance sale. Clearance. And nuclear. Um, this other non-standard is the way some people are pronounce it, nuclear, uh, I think. And um, so you will hear it pronounced a different way, but the more standard way is nuclear, nuclear. Work. Again, it looks like O-R, but it sounds like E-R, and the K will just hold in that position, work. And inspector. Inspector it looks like OR at the end, but it sounds like ER. Um, I should point out on the R practice tab, it's kind of out of sight when you first look at it, but under the ER vowel, the combination of E, ER, 
So it could be spelled all these different ways, but it can also be spelled at the end in different ways. Most commonly O-R or E-R, but it doesn't matter if it's O-R, it'll still sound like E-R. Doctor, inhibitor, receptor, harbor, all sound like er. Tutorial, tutorial. This is a good example of the I and the A going in separate syllables and being heard individually. Eel, tutorial. This, the T can disappear and you can make it a, a syllabic N. Patent, when I go up for the T, pat, I hold it, pat, N, and then I make the N noise. Patent, and it's usually used together with patent pending. Patent pending. Pending. These two T's change to a D, and you will release the D and hear it, so it sounds like pattern. And pattern, duh. <laughs> you won't hear the final D. So if there was a consonant after it, like patterned wallpaper, you won't hear the D, but you'll just have to know that it's being used as an adjective. If there was a vowel after it, then you would hear it. Patterned everywhere, patterned all over, <laughs> something with an, a vowel, but just by itself, pattern. And before a consonant, patterned wallpaper, pattern. Okay, by itself. Plethora, progress, progress, acclimating, aggravation, inspiration, Mediterranean, ornamental or ornamental, squandered, scattered, partisan, sequoia, Torrential, searing, cavalry, squeamish, cleanliness, clearance, nuclear, work, inspector, tutorial, patent, pattern, pattern. That's it. Thank you. It was good to see everyone, and I hope to see you next Tuesday for pronunciation or tomorrow on Wednesdays for intonation practice. Thanks, and have a good day or evening. I hope to see you soon.